Hey guys, it's Carrie. I'm looking at Indian animals today. Asiatic lion, the retractable claws on the Asiatic lions are crooked to allow them to hold on the prey they have got their paws on while their teeth deliver the killing bite. Lions in India do not have any natural predators as they are the top of the food chain in the ecosystem. Coalitions of males defend home ranges containing one or more female prides. Together they hold a territory for a longer time than single lions. Males in coalitions of three to four individuals exhibit a pronounced hierarchy with one male dominating the others. Bengal tiger. The claws of the tiger are up to 10 centimeters or four inches in length and are used to grasp and hold on to prey. Each paw has four of these claws and one specialized claw called a dew claw. A tiger's paw swipe can easily be 10,000 pounds. They are able to crush and break bones. The larger the tiger, the greater the paw swipe. A tiger can jump more than five meters into the air, which means they can easily jump on top of an elephant's head. When hunting prey, they use their formidable strength and weight to knock larger animals off balance. Despite their size, tigers can reach speeds of over 60 kilometers per hour. Indian leopard, their claws are retractable, needle sharp and curved. Their retractable claws are used for fighting, holding prey and for scratching tree trunks to mark their territory. They are skilled climbers. They can climb trees very quickly. Gawa bull, so strong and massively built. A gawa can be up to twice the size of an African buffalo. In the wild, they live in small herds and graze on grasses. Tigers are the only predator that can kill a full-grown adult. Wild water buffalo. Both sexes carry horns that are heavy at the base and widely spreading up to two meters along the outer edges. Indian wolf. It has a shorter coat due to it living in warmer conditions. They travel in small packs and are less vocal than other variants of the grey wolf. They have a reputation for being cunning. They often hunt in pairs when targeting antelopes with one wolf acting as a decoy while the other attacks from behind. Striped hyena. It is the smallest of the bone cracking hyenas. It is primarily a scavenger. The Bengal fox is more daintily built than the red fox and can be easily recognized by its bushy black tip tail. The basic social unit of the Bengal fox is the breeding pair formed by a pair of bonds that can last for many years. Larger aggregations may occur while grown pups linger longer than average in the natal community. Snow leopard. Their thick white grey coat spotted with large black rosettes blends in perfectly in the steep rocky high mountains where it lives. They're almost invisible in their surroundings. In Nepal, their main prey are blue sheep. Their furry paws act as natural snowshoes. Asian elephant. With reproduction, the female's urine contains a sex pheromone 
that increases before ovulation. She emits loud infrasonic calls when in estrus to attract males. An approaching bull will sniff the female's genitals and urine, placing the trunk tip into their mouth. When sexually aroused prior to copulation, couples wrestle with intertwined trunks, bite each other's necks and the male will attempt to mount. Females in estrus prefer breeding with males in musk. The male will mount her from behind and copulation lasts for about 30 seconds. An adult elephant has the largest penis of any land animal. It can reach a length of 1 metre and a diameter of 16 centimetres at the base. Unlike humans, the elephant testes do not drop. They remain high in the abdomen. Gestation lasts 18 to 22 months, the longest gestation period of any mammal. Asiatic black bear, adults can grow to 1.9 meters. They have strong curved claws up to 5 centimeters long. They are well adapted to climbing and have strong upper bodies and forelimbs. They have large padded feet and also a very long and sticky tongue. Sloth bear, they have thick 8 cm claws which are used for ripping apart termite nests. They have a large gap between their upper teeth, making the perfect space for sucking up termites. Indian Cobra is native to the Indian subcontinent and can be found throughout. They are often found in the vicinity of water. Their preferred hiding locations are holes and embankments, tree hollows, termite mounds rock piles and small mammal dens. Their venom paralyzes muscles and in severe bites will lead to respiratory failure or cardiac arrest. Indian Rhino They have thick grey-brown skin with pinkish skin folds and just the one horn on the snout. Their upper legs and shoulders are covered with wart-like bumps. They have very little body hair aside from eyelashes, ear fringes and a tail brush. Bulls have huge neck folds. Among terrestrial land mammals native to Asia, Indian rhinos are only second in size to the Asian elephant. The folds in their skin increase the surface area and help in regulating body temperature. Please stay and watch another video with me. I love to read and reply to all of your comments. Thank you for watching my video. See you again soon. See you guys in my next video.